new faces in the lineup today proved to be crucial players for the Tigers' wins against FAMU and Oklahoma State. The Tigers got started early in the afternoon against FAMU with a two-run bomb in the first inning from sophomore Georgia Clark. Clark started as a designated player for the Tigers in eight games of the 2019 season. She has since secured her spot in the lineup the past four games, batting fourth hole and starting at first base when junior pitcher Shelby Sinceri is not in the circle. Another fresh face for the Tigers' young infield is sophomore Taylor Tidwell. Tidwell has started at second base the past four games this season. She has been waiting for her breakout hit, and she finally got it against FAMU. Tidwell came up clutch with a stand-up triple, scoring two in the bottom of the seventh, and then eventually scoring herself, contributing to the eight runs in five innings. Sierra Briggs made her college debut today in both right and center field against FAMU and Oklahoma State and showed the potential to become a true freshman for the Tigers this season. Against FAMU, Briggs hit a triple to drive in the winning run. Continuing on this hitting streak, Briggs stepped up with a big hit against OSU to tie the game in the bottom of the six. Not only did she step up offensively, but she also took over center field after Alea Andrews was taken out of the game due to an injury. The star of the day, however, was freshman shortstop Taylor Pleasance. Pleasance was the playmaker for the Tigers. Despite her inexperience, she still managed to make a top 10 worthy diving catch on defense against Florida A&M and remained solid for the Tigers. Pleasance went 4-for-4 four four on the day with a single against FAMU and two singles and a walk-off home run against number 13, Oklahoma State. She's one of the hardest workers on the team. She does the work. She puts in the time. And for her to go out there and do that, that she deserves it. She, that's, what, that's who she is. As the season progresses, these underclass leaders will need to continue to step up in order for the Tigers to be successful. The Tigers will once again take on FAMU tomorrow in Tiger Park at 1 p.m. to conclude the Tiger Classic. Reporting live for Tiger TV Sports, I'm Bailey Acosta.